So this is good. I love to see this alignment. I'm still hearing that you need to still be offering some point, some point for your artist. Yeah. Yeah. I know. Some point for your artist to help him creatively because it really helps center people in their creative state. I'm really hearing you have to do some point too, and you have to promote it. And this is the perfect, and it is the, it's the perfect because people are trying to figure out how do I marry the, the magic of some point, but really alongside business and the world of like business and money and all of those things. So promote your some point as well. It doesn't have to be the feature, but you can say, and before every single one of his recording sessions, every, before every one of our interviews or before he writes, I also perform for perform some point and you can create uh, like a link to a bigger you know, information page or whatever that describes what some point is. Yeah. And I've, I've been, I haven't spoken with him about this directly, but I've been having this thought as well. It's interesting because I feel like Tim being with me and supporting me, it's like, it's cultivated me to be in a position to help an artist like him from, you know, like rise up, but support his mental health as well. Yep. And, and it's, it's just really, it's beautiful. It's fucking beautiful. So I want you to do something. I want you to do some point on him once a week. I'm seeing once a week and on like the fifth interview or third interview of the week, cause there's going to be five a week, even if it's a 10 minute conversation over zoom, the video stuff is not an angle. It's like real time. And that's yeah. what people love. Yeah. So offer some point <clears throat> now don't exhaust yourself don't do an hour like he's saying a 30 minute some point like once a week and then one once a week you're going to talk about the some point hey i just did some point before our, our call because people are gonna be like what some point how does it work what what do you what do you do what do i do hey i just did some point for 30 minutes before before our call you did say you were laying down so inadvertently you're walking your audience through what it is how it works just by that conversation. Yeah. Yeah. Like at some point, what the hell is that? Some hokey pokey, whatever. How do you feel? Did you feel more focused? Did you feel more calm? Did you feel like your energy was centered? Like, yes, that's what it, that's what you need to do. Because, and this, this is really close to you in your heart too, when it comes to Tim is the balance of the marrying of career, creative career with mental health mm -hmm. yeah that's your passion that's yeah. your passion yeah completely, so completely. So, so, some point is going to be a huge process so even after our call today he's like reach out to him talk about some point record it say i want to do it would that work for you after can we hop on a call talk about it and put it away, like start building up your videos. And then when, when you start posting about the progress and your guys's relationship and what you do for him, keep it short and sweet, but condensed and powerful. Okay. And the videos are going to allow people to see, not just read, reading. People don't spend time reading. Yeah. It's going to be short and sweet. I'm an interviewer who cares, who values connection. Check out this project. Check out what I'm doing through the Aaron Skipper Foundation, whatever it is called. Short, sweet, to the point. Let the videos talk about the emotion because it's it's there. It's documented. He is so pushing some point. He goes, look, people don't want to be medicated anymore. They're looking to be reset internally by someone who can do what you do. Yeah, yeah. And he goes, he goes you're great at it. And he yeah. goes, you care. He goes, people can go somewhere else. He goes, but people are going to come with you because you care and you always give more than you take. He goes, and that's fine, except time management and money coming in. That's, that's the, that's, that's what keeps butting heads is your time yeah. management and you kind of balancing the money that's coming in. But he goes, but if you get desperate enough, you're going to start being business savvy, which is what you need to be. But some point is going to be a huge piece of this.